ज्योतिष के क्षेत्र में अपनी सफलता का परचम लहरा चुके ज्योतिष गुरु श्री के एन राव के हाथों मेडल से सम्मानित अपनी सटीक भविष्यवाणी के लिए सुप्रसिद्ध और ज्योतिष अलंकार एवं ज्योतिष आचार्य अवार्ड से सम्मानित ज्योतिष आचार्य आचार्य रमन जी हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज आचार्य रमन वैदिक एस्ट्रोलॉजर सिंस लास्ट ट्वेंटी इयर्स टुडे वी आर डूइंग अ न्यू टॉपिक विच वुड बी एक्स्ट्रा मैरिटल रिलेशनशिप और अडल्ट्री इन एस्ट्रोलॉजी वेयर विल फाइंड आउट इफ योर पार्टनर और स्पाउस इज चीटिंग ऑन यू एज पर द होरोस्कोप और इफ ही इज ट्रस्ट वर्दी और फेथफुल विद यू फ्रेंड्स लव एंड रोमांस इज अ वेरी ब्यूटिफुल थिंग बट वेन इट हैपन्स आउटसाइड ऑफ मैरिज इट कैन डिस्ट्रॉय द मैरिज लाइफ Nobody wants a cheating spouse and loyalty is one of the very important factors in any relationships. The planets in horoscope determine the possibilities of secret love affair in astrology. As per astrology there are certain planetary positions for extramarital affairs that tell clearly if your partner will cheat on you or not in future or whether he or she would be chaste and faithful or loyal with you also we'll do it in very simple and easy way which even a person who is not very much familiar with vedic astrology would understand quite easily also friends at the end of my video if you like it then please do comment on it like it share it and also please do subscribe to my channel so friends let us start this interesting topic astrology the easy way cheating partner or spouse in astrology or extra marital relation in astrology and chase partner first of all we'll find out the top questions which are in mind of natives is my partner cheating on me the next would be is my partner chaste and faithful or loyal with me also what would be the combination of adultery in a horoscope and the timings and dasha of adultery we will be also knowing what are the houses involved and the planet positions or planets involved in extramarital relation then we'll find out what are the combinations of a chaste partner or faithful partner or how can we find out from horoscope if your partner would be faithful chaste and loyal to you also we'll do the combinations the planetary combinations which are found in horoscope which can give extra marital relation in astrology so let us start now as you can see the lagna chart or main birth chart here the first house always remain where ascendant is written the number written here can change because these are signs or rashi as three number stands for gemini four number would stand for cancer five for leo then virgo libra scorpio sagittarius and so on but the first house always remain where ascendant is written now the planets that are involved are first of all would be the moon which is the significator of mind as our mind plays a very important role in extramarital relationship then the next planet would be venus Venus is a planet of love and romance which is another important planet will take up for extra marital relationship or adultery in horoscope now the next one would be mars or rahu which is planet of aggression and passion then rahu or north node which makes a person break the social norms these are the main four planet which would be seen in a horoscope for extra marital relation or adultery in horoscope which are moon venus mars and rahu the secondary planets would be jupiter which is the planet of dharma so whenever jupiter is highly afflicted or making connection then dharma suffers so it is secondary planet for extra marital affair then saturn which is also a important planet as saturn is planet of discipline now the houses involved would be first of all would be fifth house which is house of love and romance the next house would be 
12th house which is house of bad player first house is 5th house 1 2 3 4 5 5th house then 12th house 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 12th house which is house of bad player then 8th house which is house of secrecy 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8th house is house of secrecy or house of hidden elements then 3rd house 7th house and 11th house 3rd house 7th house and 11th house which are also known as kama trikon or houses of desire so whenever 3rd 5th 3rd 5th 7th 11th 8th and 12th houses are or their lords are connected with rahu mars venus moon in horoscope then they show some kind of secret affairs or adultery in horoscope now to find out whether your partner would be loyal or faithful or chaste or whether he will cheat on you then we can find out from the horoscope if you wonder about your spouse chastity check check the 11th house you should check the 11th house and its lord both in rashi chart as well as in navamsha chart since 11th house is fifth house from the 7th house as 11th house is 7th house is this one 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and from 7th house 11th house is 1 2 3 4 5 so 11th house is 5th house from 7th house so it also states that it is indicative of spouse love affair as 5th house is house of love and romance 7th house is house of spouse so 5th from 7th which is 11th house is indicative of spouse love affair so there should be relation between one week 7th house if 7th house is very weak and the 11th house if one seventh house is weak and its lord ill placed and if 11th house contain ex expensive planet or planet which helps in expansion like guru or shukra or jupiter or venus then we can be certain that during the period of 11th house the spouse will fall into relation outside of marriage and will be into extra marital affair so to find out whether partner would be faithful or chaste you should see the 11th house and its condition friends continuing with our topic extra marital affairs in astrology or adultery in vedic astrology now we'll do the planetary combinations of adultery as you can see the lagna chart or birth chart here the first house always remain where ascendant is written the number written here can change because these are rashis or sign but the first house will always remain where ascendant is written here three number stands for gemini four for cancer then leo then virgo libra scorpio sagittarius capricorn and so on but the first house will always remain where ascendant is written now the planetary combinations of adultery in a horoscope would be when moon is in trine to mercury when moon and mercury are in one five position or moon in trine to mercury it indicates chances of infidelity mars and venus together conjunct in scorpio sign in the ninth house also causes adultery moon and mercury in conjunction in gemini causes infidelity moon conjunct mars or moon and mars together they this is also a combination where native would be inclined towards illicit relationship moon and sun if posited in the fourth house and if it is afflicted then it gives illicit relation or adultery with older mate or older in age now moon conjunct venus or moon and venus together it gives a sensuous mind and if it is afflicted then it gives extra marital relation also moon conjunct with rahu it prevents the rational decision and gives illicit relations 
Also, Venus conjunct with Rahu or Mars boost passion and lust, especially in the signs like Aries, Gemini, Libra, Scorpio. It increases the chances of infidelity in a horoscope. Now, we should also check for Punarfu dosh. The Punarfu dosh would be conjunction of Saturn and Moon. Whenever Saturn and Moon together, it causes Punarfu dosh. It makes a partner cheat and create lot of havoc and unrest in marriage and married life of the native. So, in some cases, it also gives inclination for adultery or extramarital relationship. Now, the timings and dasha of the affairs would be the dasha and antar dasha of moon, Venus, Rahu, Mars. If they are afflicted and connected with houses 3, 7, 5, 12 or 8th house. If they are afflicted, the above planet are afflicted and connected with 3, 7, 11, 5, 12 and 8th house. Then it is a chance of your partner going into adultery or relationship outside marriage. Also when above planet conjunct in transit, when they are in transit and they are together and they are conjunct and they passes over your natal chart houses 3rd, 7th, 11th or 5th house, 8th house and 12th house then it is also the time of partner which can go for illicit relationship outside marriage. Hope friends you like my video and if you did like it then please do comment on it, share it, like it and also please do subscribe to my channel. And if you need any consultation from me you can whatsapp me on double nine double one three five one three five one, or you can log on to www.astrologerraman.com. Thank you friends. अगर आप भी समस्याओं से परेशान हैं और समाधान पाकर अपने जीवन को सुखमय बनाना चाहते हैं, तो जाने माने ज्योतिषाचार्य आचार्य रमन जी से मिलकर इन सभी समस्याओं का समाधान प्राप्त करें। 3341 सेक्टर 23 हुड्डा गुड़गांव हरियाणा 122001 हमारे कांटेक्ट नंबर्स हैं 0991351351 Zero eight one three zero two zero one two zero one. हमारी वेबसाइट है www.theindianastrologer.com